Hello, 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 and welcome back to another video. I hope you're all doing well, and I hope you're all staying safe in these times of coronavirus. And in today's video, we'll be playing a game I like to call Sleep. I am deciding to do this as well. I think it'd be pretty cool to just maybe move away from Star Wars every now and then, and just play a different game. Uh, maybe we can run the game, maybe I'll do it once a week, twice a week, a few days. But um, I'll still obviously be making Star Wars videos, as I do enjoy playing those games. So anyway, we're just going to be doing just messing around the steep, trying to do some difficult tricks and um, stuff like that, because this game is about skiing, snowboarding, all that kind of stuff, and you can do loads of crazy tricks with them. So anyway, I'm just going to jump straight into it. Okay, so just before I get into it, I'm just going to do a bit of background to see like, what's the game about and stuff. Uh, I'll tell you a bit about it, hopefully doing it, making a bit more sense um, about what this game is and why I'm playing it. So in this game, uh, it has many cool features. You can do all sorts of ski, snowboard, wingsuit, rocket suit, and sled, and many other things. Um, and you can trick, you can fall, you can fall. <laughs> but yeah, these are all the other sports over here. So we've got paragliding, skiing, sledding, wingsuiting, rocket suit. Snowboard, base jump, and speed riding, which I don't have right now, but we're going to be having a look at all these today. Um, <coughs> but yeah, it's truly a very good game. Um, you can travel to different places around the world, such as Alaska and the Alps, and you also go to Japan, but there's other places, but you can't go to Japan where you just purchase the game straight away, as they come to the DLCs, as this game also just have DLCs like X Game with Winter and the Winter Olympics, which I do have those too, and I think you can be close for them. Um, in this video. Um, and it's just all around just an extreme sport game that is thoroughly um, enjoyable to play and I do play it quite a lot. <coughs> and you can also have competitions like racing, freestyle events, go to snow pods, which we will be doing today. So I'm not going to waste any more time and we're going to get straight into it. Okay, so I'm just going to start off riding this mountain or a line. Now, I've chosen to do this one first as I, it's one of the nicest, oh, that was not good, was it? That was pretty embarrassing. It's one of the nicest mountains, or well, well, not really a mountain, it's part of the mountain, or let's call it a line, that I enjoy doing. And it's just quite nice, quite easy to do, but there are some more technical ones, which are really difficult, will definitely take me a few tries, which I hope they'll be doing later in the video. And um, like really smooth, get some really big air and some good tricks off this um, line I'm going to show you right now. But yeah, I'm just going to do this line, run through, and then I think I'm going to go to Japan, which is um, you may not have if you play this game. But um, oh, I do, because so it took me a while, but I saved up a lot of credits, 100,000 to get me there. Okay, so let's just pop a trip off this rock here might fall. Oof, that was a switch double court 900 mute and if you want to know where I got that trick from it, look in the bottom left of the screen there is a scoreboard wire and the tricks I am doing so that's where it is if you want to see what tricks I am doing. And, um, yeah if you're wondering why I chose to ski over snowboard it is because I feel like they've really got the beauty of skiing in this game. Like, I'd, I'd personally prefer to do snowboarding, but I just feel like they haven't really nailed it in this game. They were not skiing, which was really nice to do, really smooth, and I really enjoy doing it. But yeah, that was the line I just did there. Um, it was really nice, really smooth, but we were getting into a lot more difficult ones, so definitely take me a few more tries than that. And, uh, now I'm just going to go and head into the mountain view and check out, we're going to go to Japan and check out the snow parks there because they have some of the really nice snow parks and we're just going to travel so there now. Here we are in Japan, we're probably going to do maybe like one or two runs on this snow park because it is a big snow park. Japan in this game have some of the biggest snow parks out of the entire game on steep with rails, jumps, it is honestly incredible how they deal with Japan here and it really is great to ride. Okay, and um, we'll be coming back to Japan at the end of the video after we've done the snowboard thing because there is one of the biggest cliff jumps in the game here where you can really get loads of flips on and we're going to see how many flips I can manage to get in one jump I'd like to say. Maybe I'd get 10, it really is that big but I don't know, usually if it's that big of a cliff jump it's really, really difficult to land. 
Okay, so we're doing a pretty smooth ride so far down here. We're probably... Yeah, there we go. Nice smooth grind there. Um, grinding in this game gets you so much points. You just go on the grind, you spin around, it gets you more points than doing a jump. Just do that, you get tons and tons of points. You still get loads of points from jumping, don't get me wrong. But grinding is really where you get the points from. Okay. Oh, up, up. It can be quite difficult to get on the grind. And I often find I struggle to get on the grind. Just gonna hit that big jump over there, and that should be the end of the snow park. And honestly, we're probably gonna run this one more time because the snow park is absolutely huge. There's so many different lines you can take that I um, won't have enough time to share with you in this entire video. But I'm probably gonna be making a few more videos on Steve because. I do enjoy playing it, but you can check out more. Okay, so that'll be the end of the snow park. I'm just going to try it again. And maybe check it one more time. We're going to go all the way over to the right this time. And we're going to ride down. Maybe doing a few more big jumps instead of the rails, because I did a lot of rail grinding on that last one. Um, there's going to be a half pipe over here, which is that. There it is. There's actually a double one there, one next to each other. And there'd be a pretty cool gap if I could get it, but we're not going to try that gap right now. We might try if we're gonna run one more time down just a little extra on the end of this but oh, I think the half pipes actually are probably the most um, my most favourite like kind of ramp in the game because I find it just really satisfying to do with the landings and stuff. Wait, getting onto this grind, we'll do a tail press. Oh I tried to backflip off and I failed. Just gonna Okay, there we go. Did a front, double front jump actually. That was nice. Okay, we've got another. Oh no, we fell. That's not good. But I want to. Go on, get up. Oh no. I don't know if I'll have enough speed now. I wanted to hit this jump over here. Try it well. Oh, we might do it. Oh, it wasn't exactly the smoothest downhill landing, but we still managed it. But Quite a nice transfer. Oh, was that Quint? Quinty? Oh no, <laughs> well, I don't know what I'm saying because that was completely wrong. Oh, I love the backflip animation in this game. Just the way you jump off the back and just feels looks so nice. Oh, the quadruple backflip, they are very hard to do quadruples on those kinds of racks. But are definitely doable because I just did it. <laughs> I hit the ramp there. That's not too good. Okay, I'm pretty sure we're about the end of this as the part for the second time. So we're jump off. Not a, not a, not a bad trick to end the run, but it could have been better. Okay, so I'm just wanna try that gap one time. Where, well, it was right up here, wasn't it? Uh, so I'd be pretty cool if I could do it because I actually haven't tried this before. Well, I have actually seen other videos of people playing Steep and I have seen, I'm pretty sure I've seen people do it, but I don't know if I'm going to nail it. We're only going to give this one attempt. Oh no, we, we haven't made it, well, that's not good. Anyway, we're going to go and look at some extreme places now with Steep, so I'm just going to travel over there right now. I'll see you there. Out of very, very extreme places on Steep. Don't get me wrong, there are even more extreme places. But this is one of them. What a very extreme place. As you can see, there's rocks everywhere. Very difficult to maneuver around. Well, getting KO'd in this game, which is basically where you fall over. And I suppose it's the equivalent of dying in this game. You don't ever really die, do you? Oh, oh you can see there. Difficult. Very difficult to do here. It may not seem that difficult from where you're sitting, but um, trust me, it's very difficult to maneuver. And very difficult to do. And we're just going to try and get a nice line going down here. Maybe nailing it, getting some tricks on it. Just go back to the doing a lot and lot of things. Just going to jump off here and pull the rock. Oh no. I'm about to have another go. So this is the line I'm probably going to go for. I'm probably going to jump off here. Trick off here. Continue down a little bit. Just do a sweet little double backflip kind of thing. And then one off here. And then we're going to chill down. And then come through here. Just let it dick off here. Then ride for a little bit. Come up and jump off here. 
Right, I'll go over all these rocks, hopefully. Have a nice landing, and then here comes a big jump. Two, three, let's get a quad flip there, the and then jump off here. And go, oh. Okay, that's going to be the end of the line. That's going to be what I want to nail. And um, I'm probably going to make another video on Steep, and just each video I'm going to keep going to an extreme place, and um, making it more extreme each video. We're just starting off here on this one. Which hopefully shouldn't be too difficult, but it definitely will be challenging. And I'm just gonna do it. And then after this, we're going to go to the probably the best clip jump in this entire game. And see how many flips we can get off the clip jump. And we've just fell there, which is not good at all. Okay, so. Oh, that was a bad start. Let's start again. That <laughs> took me way too long. Right, anyway. So let's flip. So all the way around. Flip off here. Pull over and flip across. Get me on track for the first jump over the big rocks. Hopefully avoid them. Okay, so let's just do a cheeky, add a little cheeky that bit. Jump off here. Okay, we safely pull all those rocks. We're gonna not do too many flips. Okay, here's the big jump. Okay, we've landed that now. This is where it gets difficult because we're going to land on all these little bumps. Whoa. This might take me a few tries. Right, okay. So let's flip. Oh, that was a very low flip. Doesn't matter. Flip again. Okay. Right, I think this is the one. Seems to be doing pretty well again. So the last jump, and then it's just that last jump because we've got a lot of, uh, well, I think, it's, I think it's called g force in this game, it's where the so screen high, goes like that, so that the G-Force is high, which I suppose it did. Okay, oh, that was a bit of a dodgy flip, but it shouldn't matter if we land it. Oh, we've landed it. We've landed it. We've done it well. That was nice, that was. We've done it. Oh, and we've KO'd a boy. It doesn't matter because we've done it. Anyway, now we are going to go back to Japan because this is where there's going to be a huge cliff jump. And I'm going to set myself the target of getting 10 flips. So I'll see you when I get there. Okay, here we are to close off the video. Um, I've set myself the target of getting 10 flips in a row at this cliff jump. So you start from where I just started, you go all the way down there, build up as most speed as you can, and then just flip off. Oh, well, that was not a good um, um, jump there as I went way too low, but hopefully on this one it'll be better and I can get closer to 10 flips. Okay, so let's charge the jump by holding R2 and flip. So we've got one, two, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, 10 is definitely possible, we've got 9 there. We landed that, well that's not too good, we've got 8 actually. Oh, I think 10 is definitely possible. We're going to give it a few more tries. Yeah, we'll see what happens. Okay, here we are. Coming out again. I, I wasn't filming for a bit because it was just taking me ages to make the video too long. And I actually did it on one of the ones I wasn't filming, but I'm not going to do that again. Because, well, I didn't actually land it, but I did do 10. 5. We're going to land on the rocks there. Oh. Wait, how many have we done here? That was 13! Oh my god. 13, we did more than I'd actually set myself to do. And we, we could have landed that as well, and that would have been a really, really, really good end of the video there. Okay, so we're going to try it again. Okay, so oh, well, too slow. To do Can't do that. Come on. Come back from there. Make it easier. Oh, 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 we landed it on the rocks. Right, let's keep going. there.
no, we, didn't, we landed seven. Did not, well, we, well, we landed, we landed it eight. We did do a 13, we just got to get that jump again and land it. Oh, okay, just reload it, try again. Oh, this might be it. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We've done ten. Come on, land it. Oh, we could have landed that one. I don't know what just happened to my character there. Just decided to stop flipping. By the way, no excuses. We've got to try again. Try again. This one, now we've got a grid. One. No, this is a really nice jump. Three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, no, ten, please, no. eleven, twelve, no, please, oh my gosh, thirteen. No. We, landed, we just landed a twelve rodeo, which is twelve flips. We put a rodeo basically flipping and spinning at the same time, kind of. And we just landed twelve, so we landed more than we actually set myself to do, which is which is really good. I, I, I didn't think I thought I was going to take way longer than that. Let's actually go into Mountain View and see the amount of lines I just did. Oh, well, is it not going to show me? Yeah, it's not going to show me. I thought it would show me, but it hasn't. But anyway, I am happy with that. 12 flips right there. I thought it took me a lot longer, but it actually didn't. Well, that was really good. Um, I'm actually really happy I managed to do that, because I've never actually managed to do that before. So I've actually tried, and, well, failed. But yeah. Anyway, I do hope you've enjoyed this video. I'm going to end it here. I'm probably going to be making more videos of Steve in the future, because uh, I like to play this game. And, um, yeah. So yeah, if you have enjoyed, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.